Hey everybody, Brad Sinclair here, your local realtor. And as you know, I'm running for a seat for selling counsel and it's more award. Sit back, relax, enjoy the video. It should be only a few minutes long. Well, I was reading an article this morning about the campaigning going on in the city of Corth Lakes. And it's looking like it's getting really, really nasty between the candidates in the city of Corth Lakes, which is too bad. But it does, it can happen when you're, you have a large amount of people competing for a, a few number of spots. But it's, uh, to relate that back to our campaign, I can walk away with my head high and, and feel good about everything that I've said. And in most part, I think that most counselors can do the exact same thing. So thank you for that. That's, uh, that's a good thing. The most uh, contentious issue that we dealt with was the septic reinspection program during this campaign. And it got a little heated, but that's okay. That was a pretty important, uh, that was a pretty important issue for everybody. So thank you to all candidates for that. Um, the biggest contention that I'll have with the fellow council to get in is this. I know Jerry Herring of, of Smith loves the Maple Leafs, so I think I, I always wear this in honor of him. Um, <laughs> or maybe not. <laughs> Anyways, sorry, I had to. Um, the causeway. I was looking to see if I could find an update on the causeway uh, last night because I know that the work was supposed to start uh, right after Thanksgiving. And uh, I couldn't really, I didn't find a thing. Went through all the council notes, I uh, went through the, the local newspapers. Um, I didn't find anything. So I can't even give you an update on that. But I did find an article which I found kind of interesting. Was in 2016 that uh, some of the, the Peterborough councillors um, expressed that maybe putting a toll to pay for the, the the upgrades on the causeway was a good idea. That went over not very well. Anyways, I, I just thought that was interesting that I read. Guys, that's all I have for you today. Have a wonderful weekend, and I'll catch up with you Monday.